Welcome to the Mujiwara Sketches YouTube channel, buddy. In today's video, we embark on a thrilling adventure, delving into the clash of titans in the world of swordsmanship, the legendary Dracul Myhawk, known as the world's strongest swordsman, and the enigmatic V. Nushtaro, a member of the formidable Five Elders. Join us as we unravel the secrets behind their incredible powers, their epic battles, and speculate on who truly reigns supreme in the realm of blades. So hoist your sails, sharpen your swords, and prepare for an exhilarating journey through the turbulent seas of One Piece lore. Fans have met a lot of strong bad guys in One Piece's final story, like the powerful Five Elders. In the Egghead Island arc, Oda surprised everyone by putting all five of them into fight at the same time, showing off how powerful their transformation were. As expected, all five members of the Five Elders have left fans very pleased. Their strength and abilities have truly blown people away. Each of the Five Elders has a special ability, and because they are all yokai, their abilities are very different from those of normal Devil Fruit users. Besides the yokai skills they have, they also have other skills. As a fan favorite, V. Nushiro is one of the most interesting elders. He is also a great swordsman. When talking about swordsmen in the world of One Piece, Dracul Myhawk always comes up. Fans are curious to find out which one of Myhawk and V. Nushiro is really stronger. Myhawk's strength and status as world's strongest swordsman. Right now, Dracul Myhawk is the best swordsman in the world. Myhawk is a very strong person, and he has a bounty of 3.596 billion berries. It's crazy how much this bounty is, and he definitely gets it. By this measure, Myhawk is just as powerful as the four emperors, which proves that he is truly one of the most powerful people in the world. Even though Myhawk doesn't have any devil fruit abilities, he does have a strong black blade called Yoru. One of the supreme grade swords has this blade, which is said to be a very strong blade. It is amazing how gracefully Myhawk can use this blade, and he is very good at it. People say that Myhawk is even better with a sword than Shanks. When you compare him to other swordsmen in the One Piece world, his skills are truly amazing, and he is clearly a very significant person. Fans don't know much about Myhawk's skills right now, but it's clear that he has a strong hockey. Myhawk definitely has access to Conqueror's hockey, even though it hasn't been said directly in the series. He probably also has the power to inject it. Myhawk is one of the strongest people in all of One Piece just because of these skills, and fans have already seen many of his amazing performances. V. Nustro's strength. Fans of Street V. Najuro also know that he is a fighter who has way too much power. Because he is a member of the Five Elders, V. Nushiro is very strong, which is to be expected. He has the power of a yokai too, just like the other elders. He has the power of the Bakatsu yokai in this case. With this power, Nushiro can change into a huge, bone and bone horse. As of now, the show hasn't shown what the skeleton horse's real powers are, but fans already know that he can bring the chill of the underworld to life, just like Brook. Because he can freeze things, he is already one of the strongest fighters in the world of One Piece. However, that is by no means all of his skills. Fans know for sure that Venusturo can also cut through things with his sword. The last part of his name, Juro, even makes it sound like he's related to the Wano people. Fans know that when he fights with a sword, it could be one of the supreme grade swords, this blade is most likely the Shodai Katetsu. It is said that this sword is cursed, but the fact that he has tamed it shows what a great fencer and strong-willed person he is. He was able to kill over 25 Mark III pacifistas in Egghead in the blink of an eye, which is truly amazing. On top of all these amazing skills, Venusturo also has great hockey. He can use all three types of hockey, just like the other elders. Most likely, he can also use Conqueror's Hockey Infusion, which is normal for elders. On top of that, Fans know for sure that the Elders were much stronger than Haki. Jinbi made a vague connection between Shanks and the Haki of Mars. Knowing that Shanks might be the strongest Haki user living is proof enough that Nusturo's Haki is much stronger than Myhawk's. This alone makes him a very strong person, but you also have to think about the fact that he will live forever. Like all the other Elders, Saint V. Nusturo will live forever, and fans have seen proof of this on Egghead. Could V. Nujuro be stronger than Myhawk? It is reasonable to wonder if Venusturo could be better than Myhawk. If Myhawk is known as the world's best swordsman, Venusturo might seem even stronger. 
What people should think about, though, is that Nushiro doesn't care about what's going on in the world. Due to the fact that he is a world god, his power has constantly been kept secret. Nobody could have known that Venusturo was better than Myhawk because he hasn't fought in fights in a long time, especially since the end of the Void Century. Fans may not like the idea of Venusturo being stronger than Myhawk because they think it takes away from Zoro's dream. This problem can be easily solved, though, if Zoro fights Nushiro after he becomes the strongest swordsman in the world. When Zoro beats Myhawk, he will be known as the best. But if the Great War happens after that, Zoro will need a strong opponent. After that, Zoro's next opponent should be someone better than Myhawk, maybe even the person who matched up with or beat Ryuma. Nushiro could be the person in question. As a result, Myhawk's title as the world's strongest swordsman in Zoro's dream would still be valuable. V. Nushiro would become the strongest, and Zoro's dream would still have meaning after he becomes the strongest. Absolutely, fans can see right now that V. Nushiro is the better fighter. Summary and Highlights In One Piece, the Five Elders are very strong and have special powers and yokai forms. Myhawk is the best swordsman in the world. He uses a strong black blade and has amazing sword skills. V. Nushiro is a member of the Five Elders and a powerful fighter who can freeze things, live forever, and might be stronger than Myhawk. As our adventure through the world of One Piece comes to a close, we've explored the depths of swordsmanship and witnessed the clash of legends. The stories of Dracul Myhawk, the epitome of mastery, and V. Nushiro, the enigmatic elder with untold potential, have left us with minds buzzing and hearts pounding. But the journey doesn't end here. Share your thoughts, theories, and speculations in the comments below. Who do you believe holds the true title of the strongest swordsman? Keep the spirit of adventure alive, and until our next voyage, may the winds of the Grand Line guide you to new horizons and thrilling discoveries. Thank you very much for visiting the Mujiwara Sketches YouTube channel, buddy. We hope you enjoy our review analysis. Don't forget to subscribe to continue joining us on our joyful journey in the world of anime. If you have any wishes, questions, or suggestions for our next videos, feel free to express your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you very much for your support, and until we meet again. See you next time, buddy. What is One Piece anime? One Piece is a manga and anime story about a young boy named Monkey D. Luffy who wants to be the king of the pirates in the world. As a child, he eats a devil fruit, a strange plant that makes him able to stretch like rubber. Before the show starts, Luffy goes out into the world for the first time and starts to gather a group of pirates. The main group grows over time, but it starts with Luffy, Nami the Navigator, and a swordsman named Rorano Azoro. At some point, Luffy and his friends are known as the Straw Hat Pirates, and they go on many exciting adventures across the ocean. One Piece is a lot of fun because it's silly. Luffy goes from island to island around the world in the series. Each island has its own setting and theme. It's a pretty fantastical world full of animals that look like people, live skeletons, and other delightfully strange things. Within moments the group is in a winter scene, and the next they are on a tropical island full of giants. The show is full of silly and bright details. For example, Zoro holds a sword in his mouth, a scary military boss wears a cute bulldog hat. And people don't use phones to talk to each other instead, they use special transponder snails that can send and receive messages. Luffy is a carefree person who just wants to eat a tasty meal and laugh at bad jokes. Even though there are some funny parts in the series, a lot of One Piece is about freedom. During his travels, Luffy often takes up guns to help his friends and encourages others to do the same against pirates and government-backed military occupations. The characters in Luffy and his crew get stronger with each fight, which is typical for shonen manga. A lot of the story is about how Luffy beats a problem that seemed impossible to solve and finds some kind of secret power. After each fight, Luffy and his team get stronger and move closer to his main goal, which is to find the One Piece. Why is it called One Piece? The first part of both the manga and the anime shows that Pirate King Gold D. Roger is telling the truth about the mythical wealth called the One Piece. One Piece is the name of the show because Luffy wants to find the One Piece and become the next Pirate King. One of Luffy's main goals in the show is mentioned in the show's title. What is the One Piece? The answer to this question is still one of the biggest secrets in the series. 
It's been more than 1,000 episodes, and we still don't know what One Piece is. We know that the One Piece is the name of the treasure that Gold D. Roger collected on his travels because of details in the manga. We still don't know a lot about the treasure, though. There are a lot of ideas from fans about what the One Piece is, but we still don't know what it is or even if it's real. The One Piece could just be the friends Luffy makes along the way.